Bangla reported 100 cases of domestic violence every month in 2022. Almost 7,000 cases of domestic violence were filed by women nationwide in 2022. This is a jump from the previous year. According to data, most cases are related to harassment by spouse and dowry. Most cases were reported from Uttar Pradesh, Delhi and Maharashtra. <laughs> As experts say, the numbers are only indicative of the violence which are reported. Women started reporting more after the pandemic as it led to awareness. Economic opportunities and pay have shrunk after the pandemic, leading to a rise in friction in families and therefore violence. The history of domestic violence has been an upward trajectory. Kumkum Kumar, who has been working with the survivors of domestic violence, talks about the issue. They're not sure that if they approach a particular authority, they will get redressal. And what time the in, in what time that redressal will come? And in between, where will she stay? Then you need those systems, structures, processes to support her so that she can make a new life out of her, I mean, you know, in, by herself. As experts say that once violence begins, it becomes repetitive in nature. Violence is not something which starts suddenly and comes down quickly. There can be mental and verbal abuse prior to physical abuse. The proximity and the duration which people were spending together enhanced the violence during the pandemic. And from then on, it has not gone down. Major reasons stopping women from coming out remain livelihood, access to institutions where they can go, report and get redressal. This is also reflective in the conviction rate which is only 16%. Every police station is empowered to deal with women's related issues but to have more focus and focused investigation of this case, we have the women, all women police stations in uh, two locations in Bangalore city. According to experts, there need to be more institutions for redressal and societal sanctions. Ridham Sharma reporting for CityCast, Bangalore.